hello 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 welcome and good morning good afternoon good evening this is the village wanderer and welcome to my channel thank you very much for uh, choosing to watch my content and today i will give you 10 reasons why i love kitale i moved here about four years ago and uh, people keep asking me what is it about this town so today i'm sharing with you those 10 tips about why i love kitale enjoy number one kitale is a cosmopolitan town with people from different parts of the country this makes it easier to settle in as you do not feel like an outsider number two there are a number of tourist attractions within Kitale town and its environs like the Kitale Museum, Kitale Nature Walk, Saiwa Swamp and further out the Mount Elgon National Park. This is ideal for both visitors and residents who are keen on outdoor recreation. Number 3 Kitale has a number of decent hotels and recreation spots. They may not be star rated but for someone who's not fussy, they get the job done. Cost of living is lower than Nairobi, from housing to food, schools to cost of labor, etc. etc. It's easier to get by, but also take into account incomes are generally lower in the countryside. Number five, Kitale has a consistent water supply, which is a big relief from the perennial Nairobi water shortages. I still marvel at the fact that there is water in the tap every single day. Number six, ease of movement. Kitale is a small town, so everything is within walking distance. The town center, hospital, supermarkets, food markets, ETC. Saves time, money, and less stressful. Number 7 Kitale is about 40 kilometers to the Ugandan border so I'm looking forward to making a trip or trips to explore Uganda So at this point just allow me to interject to say that uh, this the experience I'm talking about uh, may vary depending on uh, different people so different people have different experiences and uh, what i'm alluding to is my experience so please don't uh, come at me in the comment section because this is my experience which i'm just sharing and uh, the experience may vary depending on uh, where you live or or just different factors so uh yeah uh, maybe you can share your experience as well in the comment section so that we get to exchange notes and just see uh, uh, Share our different experiences and get to learn and even to just inform all the, the people who are out there what to expect When they come here, so that 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 would be ideal uh, if we can share experiences and just uh, inform uh, and give knowledge to those who have uh, no clue about what to expect when uh, coming to Kitale. Number eight, there's a lot of untapped business potential for aspiring and established entrepreneurs in sectors like real estate and the hotel industry. Number nine, the potential for growth. With the right leadership, the town is strategically placed for booming cross-border trade with Uganda. Finally, the people here are more community-oriented and will always come together for common causes. You are most likely to be a member of a church community or your neighborhood. Now my bonus point on why I love Kitale is the security. Uh, I've had my phone stolen a number of times in Nairobi. Uh, this has never happened in Kitale. I've had a few instances of near break-ins. One incident actually of a near break-in in my house. But apart from that, 
uh, the security here is not uh, bad at all. Uh, you can use your phone in the town center, you can uh, go about your business without having to worry, to look behind your back. So that's something that has relieved a lot of uh, the strain of always looking at your back and always worrying about your security. I see people uh, moving about late into the night, early in the morning. But then again, this depends on where you live or this depends on the areas you frequent. So my experience might be different from somebody else's experience. So as usual, you just have to be careful. Uh, don't walk in places at night and uh, especially places that are deserted but uh, with regard to security uh, my feeling is that the security here is uh, a bit more a bit better than uh, the security uh, situation in Nairobi so these are my 10 points why I love Kitale after relocating from Nairobi. I will also do a video on 10 misconceptions people have about living in a rural town. Stay tuned for that. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching. Please make sure you subscribe to the channel. You can also give the video a thumbs up and hit that notification bell so that you're notified each time I upload a video. Until the next one, bye bye.